we're at Trans World 2016, and I've stopped at Pro Air's booth because we have a very lovely eye-catching model here, Ray. And Donna owns Pro Air, and Avi is the artist who has made up Ray to be as remarkable as she is. Can you guys tell us a little bit more about Pro Air and about your work and about modeling? Well, I gotta say that Pro Air is the old alternative product on the market right now that provides awesome color coverage and the best thing is the, the model at the end of the day or even tomorrow it all comes off with liquid soap it's so easy and it's a great prop um, product I was working with ton of different body paint and pro hair just going fluid on the airbrush and it's uh, very vibrant and the UV popped right on the body and so much fun to work with those colors. And thank to my model that she was awesome to work with as well. <laughs> so uh, what got you into body painting? Well, I do airbrushing for over 12 years and I started uh, doing body painting for the last six years. Um, I did few reality shows since then and, and it just fun to work with 3D canvas that moving and transformation so super fun. Well the work is beautiful. Can you tell me a little bit about your experience? When did you start modeling like this? As I am like way impressed by you just being here and wearing this beautiful art. Um, well, I actually started with her um, right after I graduated from college. I got an email saying that there was a Halloween convention in town. They needed a booth news assistance. So I emailed Donna, Donna was like, yeah, we need someone. And then she's like, hey, would you want a body paint model? And I was like, sure. And um, it just kind of snowballed from there. Ever since then, I've worked with Donna a few times now. Why don't you tell her what you did when you got done? Oh, when I got done, uh, our first day, uh, so the first day that we did it, after being here all day, I went to dinner with some friends. I went to the Muse concert in my body paint. Oh. I went to a house party and then to a few bars and the paint was on me the entire time, like still intact. And uh, it was quite the adventurous night. And now it's just become a habit that every time we're done, we'll take off like the accessories and then go out on the town in our body paint. Oh, that sounds like a blast. Yeah, sure. uh, does that need any like a barrier sprayer? Um, it's, no, it's a uh, water smudge proof. It lasts long and it's super easy to take it off with so soap and water. And, and if we want to know more about um, Pro Air and your products, where can we find you? Very easy. It's proair.com. P R O A I I R because all eyes are on you. Well, thank you for your time. I have one surprise question to ask you before we leave. I think I might already know the answer to it, but we've been asking everybody at Transworld, do you prefer makeup and prosthetics or a mask? What was that again? Do you prefer makeup, makeup and prosthetics? Or a mask? Oh, makeup, and makeup of course. <laughs> that was kind of an easy well, one. Well, the thing is, with the Pro Air line, they go hand in hand. The Pro Air, you can spray right on prosthetics. And it blends just great. So yeah. both. it looks phenomenal. So beautiful work, all three of you. And thank you for your time. This has been Destiny with Haunt News Network. We bring you all things haunted.